One of the core values of the National Federation of Occupational Pensioners is to put members at the heart of everything it does. With more choice available now, NFOP has worked in partnership with the Retirement Income Alliance to provide an independent, tailored guide to positive retirement planning. More from Nick Thatcher. Abby Higgins has enjoyed an active career as a dancer, a fitness teacher and a potter. But while she has no intention of slowing down anytime soon, she is considering what retirement will mean for her and how she'll fund the kind of life she'd like to lead. Well, in the old days, people would have one job and they'd have a pension pot with the job. And my life hasn't been like that at all. I've done a variety of different things and it's always been on a self-employed basis. So I've never really built up any kind of pension provision. Really, at the age of 60, I'm kind of thinking, whoops, <laughs> what do I do now? And uh, you know, so that's why I'm starting really th to think about pension and what assets I've got and what I can do with them. And Abby is not alone. Thousands of us, whether we have private or workplace pension provision or not, are unclear as to what the future holds. In Bristol, we met these volunteers planting an edible garden. But when it comes to retirement, are they also busy cultivating plans to serve them in later life? If my dad hadn't talk to me about it I suppose no, no. he set me up a pension um, like years ago but um, I've got the paperwork I've just not <laughs> taken a big interest in it, I guess it's really confusing there's lots of places that say you can come and talk to us but equally they're very often very conflicting in what they tell you when you're younger it's the last thing you think about so now we're at a point where okay perhaps I better start thinking about it now I've met you uh, you've planted a seed <laughs> With so much choice and change in pension provision, it's easy to see why so many of us can get confused as to how best to plan for our retirement, or even to know how much we'll need to fund the kind of lifestyle we may want to lead. So getting early, independent guidance and support not only allows us to make informed decisions now, but can also give us greater freedom and flexibility in later life. And this online resource from the Retirement Income Alliance, in partnership with the National Federation of Occupational Pensioners, is designed to give people the knowledge and confidence to explore all the options available to them and to positively plan for the retirement they want. There are tools, calculators, uh, you can even draw up a plan using some of the stuff that we've got on there and it will help you get a better rate for your savings, for example, and a range of other things that it does. It's not just about pensions, it's about all the other things you could do to make your financial situation better in later life, from carrying on in work, from maybe even starting a small business, through to factors such as drawing on the equity in your house or even moving abroad, which is a solution financially for many people that they don't understand they've got. We've developed a website that is a membership-based organisation you join the organisation, you get free access to the web services. It's not designed to replace the work of an independent financial advisor. It's preparing you to be able to talk to an independent financial advisor with the knowledge of what you want to achieve and where you're aiming to get to. It has given me lots of options and it's not too late and I feel much better about the fact that, you know, I have got money in a house and I have got uh, some shares and things like that and what I can do with them and how I can make them work for me uh, as best they can and so it does actually give me more confidence and I do feel better about it. And with more confidence and knowledge of the options open to us we're more likely to make better choices and enjoy the retirement we want to live.